Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for coming back and viewing. Today is actually something I've been wanting to do for a while. Changing my lifestyle a little bit more. Um, basically, I'm trying to live my life with less. I want to actually try to utilize the stuff that I want, that I have, and um, work my way into easing my way into minimalism what am i doing today today i am creating this project pan if you guys don't know what project pan is it's basically you take an item whether it's uh skincare makeup basically i'm just trying to use up the stuff that i have be more happy with the things that i do have and use use basically use them up because i want to get rid of it your goal is to try to finish that product so that's why it's called project pan so for example i have this palette your goal is to finish let's say this certain color and you want to hit pan on that and then that's that's your goal is to finish that one specific color and then you keep your new goals until you finish uh that product or that whole palette or whatever your goal was goal is so for me i like i said i want to constantly try to get things out of the way out of my life you guys are planning to do this you can have a set time limit it doesn't have to be a year it doesn't have to be two weeks it doesn't have to be a month you could set it for when whatever time frame you think you're going to be able to hit it so for me i want to try to use these products up within a year but i want to be making updates of me finishing up those products go ahead and get on with the video if you guys haven't already don't forget to subscribe to my channel also click the notification bell so you do know when i do upload and follow me on all my social media i'm at Geraldi Silva uh, and at bait manager so thank you guys so much for watching and let's go ahead and get on <laughs> couple of things i have skincare um and i have some makeup products that i'm just like i i need to start rotating i need to start getting them out of my life so for me i'll get started on the skincare because it's actually pretty easy and it makes kind of sense on why i want to do it so let's let's go on with that so this one is probably a no-brainer this is the genius liquid collagen algenist so when i bought this i actually got i guess a little fooled with the packaging but the packaging the advertising of this product and i regret getting it so much um but you guys are going to judge me a lot it's okay because you know i've lived and i learned and i've learned through this product that i shouldn't always be so fooled with the packaging alginus this thing cost me a hundred dollars and i regret it so much <sighs> basically i had a gift card and i was like oh let me look around let me see what stuff i can get right and then i saw this and i'm like <gasps> liquid collagen i'm trying to do anti-aging i must get it and so i got it and it, i've used it up i've used it up has it made a difference well, not really not that i've seen a huge amount of like oh my god this is so life-changing maybe just like a little bit but it could be also from other products that i'm using which you will see so i don't know i feel like i'm i'm not gonna purchase this again basically i'm just gonna use it up not purchase it again and not be fooled with packaging so i'm almost done that's one thing of that's just getting out the way so continuing on with skincare so another thing that i have is this CeraVe hydrating facial cleanser for normal to dry skin and i actually really 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 enjoy this um so much so that i want to finish it up <laughs> so i want to finish this up because i have another cleanser basically waiting for me to be used for me to use it and i don't want to go using products different products every every time just because i have an i have one waiting for me or i want to try a new one i want to use up the product and then move on to another one i don't want to just have half used bottles all around which has happened to me before and i don't like it it just drives me insane so i want to use this up completely before i move on to my next cleanser and i'm yeah, I'm pretty excited. I'm halfway there. I've used this for a couple months. I enjoy it so much. I don't have any complaints with this. 
and so yeah so I'm gonna use this up it's probably gonna take me a couple months to do that because it's taken me a couple months just to get halfway so this is my last skincare this is the Estee Lauder perfectionist pro rapid renewal treatment I've talked about this on my Marshalls haul if you haven't watched that already I'll put the little link up here for you to watch or up here I think it might be up here I'm gonna put the link up here for you guys to watch um, but I've already talked about this product. I really, really enjoy this product so much that I want to finish it and basically buy a new one already. Like, I, I will I will purchase another one. I'm not sure if I'll purchase, purchase this exact one or find one similar. If I don't find anything that works as well as this, then I'll probably just repurchase this. This cost me a quite bit of money. This one was actually $60, but it works wonders. I enjoy it so much and you just need the smallest little dot on your face i mean on your finger and it works for your entire face you don't put a lot you don't go you do not go over overboard with this product use a like a pea sized amount put it all over your face and you're good to go so i'm gonna definitely use this up and then yeah see how well this works because this works wondrously all right then so now getting into my makeup products and the stuff that i really want to get rid of well, especially this one. So, this is my Revlon Photo Ready Concealer. The reason why I want to use this product up so much and so quickly is because I actually lost the cap. I actually lost the cap to this makeup product, to this concealer. And I, like, to you guys, it might be like, oh, girls, like, bacteria, blah, blah. It sits in my drawer, so a dust doesn't really fall into it. It's not like it's exposed like out in the open air. It's like it's in my drawer, so I know it's not being as exposed as to if it was just on a little cap. Plus, I always wash my face before I use makeup products, so I'm, I know it's not getting as much bacteria as it would be if I was dirty, I guess. So for me, I just want to use this product up before it just before it just gets ugly. And by that I mean like have so much bacteria and whatnot. So I just want to use up this product because I feel like it's such a waste. I still have a good amount to go and I know I can use this up. I know I can use this up in about two, three months. I'm pretty sure I'll I'll be able to be good with this because I use concealer every single day. So I'm going to use this up. thing is this Revlon, Revlon Super Length Mascara. Mascara is one of those things that just goes bad very very quickly and i have so many mascaras that i'm pretty sure are already dry and no good to use uh so i want to start just getting rid of my mascaras by finishing them up and then calling it a day and then for me from now on once i finish a mascara for me it's like a, once i get through all of my mascaras i will only have one mascara in my collection one or two it just expires so quickly that there's no use to have so many of them basically it's it's literally just a waste of money by constantly buying new mascaras and then they just expire and then by before you get the chance to finish it up it's already expired and i feel like that's such a waste of money um so for me it's like i want to i want to use it up as fast as i can so that i can get rid of it and get the get as much use as i can with my mascaras because like i said they just expire so quickly if you guys don't know on the back of the makeup products it actually has it actually tells you how long I have before this this mascara or this makeup product expires so for, for this is about six months still gonna finish this up I'm gonna finish it up guys okay so another product that I want to try to use up I've had this for an, this is one another one of the products that I've had for a good while this is the nyx strobe of genius illuminating pad i actually got this for like i think two dollars i'm not quite i don't remember quite sure but i want to try to utilize this one i want to hit pan on this so i have a feeling that it might take me a while because when it comes to highlighting you don't really utilize a lot of highlighting unless you use it in like multiple different ways which i'm gonna try my hardest to do so i can get so i can you know use it up basically so this is one of the products that i really really want to try to use up i also have this cover girl true magic the sun kisser i actually used it today and i actually really enjoy it i don't know why i hadn't used it more often before i actually really enjoy it really enjoy it and i feel like it's good especially for dry skin because it's not it's not a powder consistency it's more of a cream consistency so for me i feel like it just glides on so perfectly on my skin and it doesn't cling to any 
to any uh, dry flakes or any dead skin cells that are have remained on my face. I feel like this is such a good product. I want to get the use out of it before it goes bad. Last but not least, my makeup palette. So I have this from the Too Faced Watermelon Palette. Uh, watermelon Palette. I think this is so freaking stinking cute palette. Um, oh! I actually have this palette on my eyes today. It's what I use to create this look. So if you guys want me to create recreate this look, comment that down below and I'll be so happy to do it. Um, so I used this palette to do it and I'm, I want to try my hardest to utilize as much as I can with this. So this also has, you know, a highlight, a blush, and a bronzer. So don't need anything else other than that. And then it has the makeup then it has the eyeshadow the eyeshadow colors that I used for today. So I used this one, this one, and I believe this one. And this one too. Oh, and this one. So I used a lot of the palette. But it's so cute. I feel like I can create multiple different looks. So if you guys want me to do a tutorial on like four looks, one palette, or uh, the look I am I have on today, just comment that down below and I'll be so happy to do it. So yeah, that's all the stuff that I am going to try my hardest to use up. I, like I said, I'll be making updates on how the progress is going and if I've used it up or if um, it's taken me a while and whatnot. So I'll probably be making this every month. Um, I'm going to try. If it doesn't get as much views, then I'll probably just like do it every other month. But if you guys enjoy it, I'll definitely make it every single month an update on how I do. Um, pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also, click the notification bell so you do know when I do upload. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye! Mwah.